Hello everybody, it's been a long time once again, and I, this is Multiman37, back here with another review, this time of the Russia Gatai series 9 and 10, Police Russia and Fire Russia. To be honest, it really should have been 9 and then 10, because these are in the wrong order, because they appear... For whatever reason, they did the same thing with Tank and Car Carrier, where they're in the wrong order that they appear in the show. So, I don't know how that works. But basically, these two are the emergency response reshas that, um, that's just what I like to call them. One is a fire truck, um, and one is a police car thing. They both have, you know, same mold. Um, but we'll get into that as soon as we look at the boxes, which is basically the same as, uh, car carrier and tank. Police rush on the front of number nine. We have the Tokyo police, Tokyo police, the Tokyo changer, and uh, what's on the top, bottom, then... All your information can be found on the back. And number 10, the Fire Russia with the Fire Russia diesel o fire. Um, diesel o fire, uh, it, what it's doing in the changer. Picture here, picture here, and all your info on the back. Now let's start with the um, reshas separated from the body areas. Um, these are the parts that go into your Tokyo changer. First is the police resha. Um, in the, actually like this, it actually looks pretty sleek like this, um, but it does have a body, so we gotta respect that, I guess. Um, now obviously this came before, but obviously they did in the wrong order. You can hitch them together. Um, a little code, and uh, there's a little thing that comes in here, which I'll get to later on. And then fire Russia, which is basically a fire truck. Um, it looks pretty nice. It looks um, just as red as the. Red Russia. Actually, let me take out the one on Tokyo as well, so I can compare it a little better. Um, they have the about the same redness. I think this one's a lot lighter though. Actually, I need to. Hang on a minute. I'll be right back. I am sorry about that. Uh, apparently, nature was calling. Um. That was a little bit too much information, but screw it. Um, like I was saying, they do have the about the same redness. I think this one's a little lighter, though. Um, but I digress. I'm going to put this back on Tokyo. There we go. Um, now let's see what they do in the Tokyo Changer. Okay, Russia summoning. <laughs> First police Russia. So there's uh, police Russia, the henching. And the transfer, which I will be transferring into fire. Summoning.
So this one actually goes uh, for a little more than how this one gets cut off. Um, and then Um, let's switch these back, that's the wrong way. So let's take a look at, uh, Fire, actually I'll start with Fire Resha this time around. Fire Resha attached to the body, um, it's okay, it does have a little hose right here. Um, the little nozzle on top does move. And, you know, it's got the little sirens, they're basically the same, except these are yellow, these are red. Um... And, um, you know, it does roll, and it does make my camera fall over constantly. Basically, um, pretty cool. Why? Come on, don't fall. Also has another feature in back. Um, if I could angle my camera right, um... The hose does rotate, which I love, and it can move in different directions. You know, it's used somehow. This shoots out both water and fire. I don't know why it just does, but you know it does. And you know, it disconnects from the peg here, and. Uh, I don't, I don't know why, it just does. Um, but, you know, that's what it looks like when it comes out. There is a little bit of detail um, when you take it out. And you can also separate it, take out the little peg, and then you can make it rotate. It's actually pretty cool. I feel like I should put this on the back of the diesel, uh, of the diesel train, um, just because it goes to diesel up. Um, speaking of which, we will start the Gatai for, uh, fire. I'm gonna bring out my boxes, which are a bunch of legendary collection Yu-Gi-Oh boxes. So, um, and there we go. And, uh, yeah, yeah. I don't know why I told you this, uh, but, uh, I should probably... Somehow this was a bad idea, huh. which means I'm gonna. So, so yeah. Here's something we haven't done with Diesello. We um instead of giving a Russia Gatai. Armament. I'm trying to carefully tap the screen. Um, to Tokyo, we're instead giving it to Dieselo. And what we need to do to prep Dieselo is just to take off the Diesel Resha, um, the smaller version. And then you take your Fire Resha, separate it, and then the this part will go to where Diesel Resha stood. And then, as for this part, flip it down, there's a little handle, and that's the little hole, right? The little hole right there is where the it connects to tr different trades. And flip it down, and now we got a fire extinguisher, which is, this is actually what it looked like when they found it. Um, it was kind of looked like this, and when it was uh, sticking out of the ground. I don't know why it was doing that, it just did. And then, you can give it to the hand of Dieselo. And then, crud. Okay, the arm broke off. I don't know why it did, but it did. Um, um, so there we have 
diesel o fire. I didn't mean to drop it, I meant to focus the image. Which is now turning into dropping it. The only problem with this is that you can't have both of these things up. Oh, wow. Because, uh, uh, yeah, normally that would happen, but for whatever reason it didn't do that online. Um, oh, yeah, I guess it's because it's a granite countertop. Oh, the leg was bent, that's why. Oh, yeah, under, no under normal circumstances. I guess you can have the arm out if the hose is collapsed. Let me just yeah I... um yeah I guess you can have the hose like that but uh officially it's supposed to be that that like that um this thing's very top at V now that I have both of them so you can only have like one thing pointing down and one thing pointing up. But yeah, this is something we haven't done, or at least I haven't done with Diesel O yet, because I was doing other things. Now I'm going to put it back to normal view for a moment, um, to bring in. Now, here's Police Russia. It, um, what it can do, it, uh, I think it does this when it's, um, in police mode too, is that you can flip this out and it has a little gun. And I think it also does it when it's by itself too. And, you know, it can shoot things. And this one is indeed the fastest of all the Russias. Makes sense because, uh, like, police cars have to be fast to catch things. Um,. So it would make sense. And then you also have this little thing, which if I disconnect it, these are actually a pair of handcuffs. And he did, they did use it, they did separate out when they were in giant form to trap a dark liner. This also comes off too. I don't know why, but it does. And then, of course, the peg to attach to make the whole thing swivel. Okay, um, anyway, as I lift up the view of my camera, as it poorly stands up, Okay, there we go. Um, now we're doing a little something a little bit expected is using Police Russia with Tokyo. Um, so take off yellow and pink Russias. And then you separate police into ha in half, into half, in half, what am I saying? As we attach, flip out the gun, flip out the handcuffs. You can have the handcuffs open if you want. Um, and there we have Tokyo Police. Pretty cool, actually. You know, it's got a little police gun thing. But, uh, yeah. Hey, I'm better police thing. Get out of here. Delta Max Megas or I'll review you some other time. Yeah, I'll I'll get to reviewing that one some other time. Uh, <laughs> I had to make that joke because Delta Max Megazord was sitting right there. Um, but yeah, this thing is actually pretty cool. Um, yeah, basic. Um, it is actually cool if uh, you get the elbow joints from the pre-order set that I just received, which I'll review at one point. 
um, as soon as I put this one up. So, overall, these two reshes are actually pretty cool, and it's the first time we actually get to see an armament for Diesel O. Uh, you can switch spots with the arms, uh, have Diesel O Police and Tokyo O Fire. Actually, one thing that they did is made Chul Tokyo O Fire. Um, carefully. Trying to carefully focus the camera. I mean, these two are pretty sick. And you should, by all means, get these. These are pretty worth it. And they're only a couple bucks, too. Um, not as expensive as what I'm going to be getting sooner or later, but th they're something. Um, so until then, I'll see you guys later. Take care. Police smash! Fire splash! Shh. <laughs>